Hello and welcome to another Top Table Gaming video. You with me, Jay and uh, Steve. Steve, yeah. I got you. It's all right. I'll stay. <laughs> And we've, we're filming a video today, and this is an event announcement video. It is. And it's involving the uh, hashtag GBTC, which yeah. we've been dropping around been for Been dropping a while. it into all my videos, yeah. uh, putting some posts up on the uh, the Hobbit group. But yeah, so some of you guys have spoke to me briefly about it, um, but this is the official this announcement. This is the official announcement. Should we tell them what it is? Yeah, go for I it. think they figured it out in about yeah, three yeah. seconds. <laughs> so the GBTC is the Great British Team Championship event. It's going to be cool. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be cool. Really good. Um, this is an event run by both of us. Yep. So as a lot of you know, in, in like I say, in the Hobbit community, that I run the Scar and Cheshire, which I've been very fortunate every time that I've done it, including the one coming in January for the league opener next year, um, has been a success. Um, mm. It's sold out really well um, and I like to sort of keep a high standard to the, the prizes and our well, custom boards and things like that um, and Jay's not bad at running events either eh mate? Yeah I'm alright, <laughs> uh, I run an annual Guild Ball event Vengeance which is 1-8 to eight players um, and it's the world's biggest and it's quite widely renowned so we yeah. figured we could come together yeah. and deliver like a world class Hobbit event that hopefully with some stuff has not been yeah. seen before. So the best of what I do and the yeah. best of what you do, is that I'm hoping it's going to be really good. We're really excited. Yeah we are. Um, We've been planning this for about three months. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's been sorts for a long while. Um, it basically, it's, it's a team, it's going to be a team format, so it's going to be teams of four. Mm -hmm. um, so each team, like I said, has four players um, and there's going to be 16 teams initially. Mm. with a scope for more if the demand is higher. We've kind of set our standard, at, well our, our target at 16 teams, I think that we can do achieve that because yep. there's a lot of teams now, a lot of the other events uh, that have a, a, a team sort of part, yes. part to it, you know, yeah, a lot yeah. of people have already come together and created their teams and there's a lot of banter that goes around so I think we'll just try to jump on that really and, and do it domestically rather we, I than... I mean we've played a couple of doubles events together yeah. and it's good fun playing, awesome. you're playing your game but you're also playing with your mates yeah. and you could lose your game but we could all win the round and yeah. it's good fun. I've recently just got back from a World Team Championships at Guild Ball as well yeah. and it was just great fun, the camaraderie and having a laugh yeah. and yeah. winding the other teams up and yeah. we reckon it could just be a funny weekend because that's what it's about. It is going to be fun, it is yeah. going to be fun. Um, the goodie bags we're quite yeah. excited about. I mean, the, the tournament is not about the goodie bag, but, but the goodie bags we're really excited about. They're going to be goodie bags like you've never seen in, in, the, in the in the GBHL anyway, like you've not seen. Um, yeah. We're trying to do it so that you know when you when you pay a price for your ticket, you're getting value for money and you're getting something Absolutely. back. So it's not just about the guys who are podium and the guys who are winning the top prizes. Everyone's going to go away with something and be really happy. I think. Some are pretty. Yeah, we, yeah, we'll, we'll do we'll do another All video right. on. That. what they are but they're yeah. awesome they're awesome yeah. um, we'll do some more teaser vids on that and the reveals yeah it's a full weekend event it is Saturday Sunday so full weekend so get in hotels and we'll have some festivities and drinks on the Saturday yeah yep. yeah we've got some stuff planned for the Saturday night it's gonna yep. be awesome it's gonna be at which we've not mentioned we haven't Element Games. Yeah. Um, a lot of you know Element Games because there's a lot of events. Isn't there. every event <laughs> Element Games? <laughs> well, it suits the format, I think, it perfectly. Um, you know, I've done Hobbit events in Altrincham, where I live, and I just don't think there's anywhere locally to me that would be able to hold a four man team event. The thing is, as well, we could find places, but Element will take it comfortably, yeah. and they've got the facilities now. Yeah. The toilets are alright after the refurb. Yeah. Got a pretty good bar, so. Kind of covers all the areas that nerds need, right? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's it's, it's going to be awesome. Yeah. Um, so like I say, Saturday night's going to be really cool. We've got like a quiz and other games and things sorted out for that. Mm. My boards from the Scarlet Cheshire will be there. Yep. Plus extras. So I've already started working. Yeah, I've for got. Next year. <laughs> I'm working on them for the league opener, as as a lot mm. of you know. Um, but then I've got from the league opener to July. We're looking yeah. at um, to get more boards for the event and the event itself we're trying to keep the prices as low as possible yeah. so as far as individuals what you pay out it's going to be a, it's going to be on the lower budget we're going to keep it, the cost as down as possible yeah. we're, ultimately we want to just get everyone together and have a good yeah, time yeah we just want to we want to have the fun aim. yeah we want to have fun there's going to be <coughs> bragging rights and things like that the prizes mm. like we said are going to be cool there's a possibility of uh, a bit of renown yeah, yeah, we'll say more about that. Yeah, later. but we'll, we'll go into some. Yeah, that'll be fun. That'll yeah, be it fun. Will. It'd be worth. It'd be worth trying to win. But yeah. you know, we don't want to be too beardy about it. Um, the other prizes are going to be cool as well. Yeah, we've got so, some good stuff planned. Yeah, we've, we've, we're we're yeah, quite man. sort of sort of seasoned now in mm. working out what people want as prizes. Yeah. Um, Fredos, right? 
yeah, yeah, for those, yeah, standard. Um, but mm-hmm. that's it. So I mean, there's a few teams already that you can yeah. think of. Team so, Knots. Team Knots. They can come and. Uh, We'd like to see you there. Yeah, and stop winning our events. Yeah. Uh, we've got Team Manchester. Can we get Team Manchester? We could probably have a couple of teams from Manchester. If we ever get our shirts there. sorted, that's been <laughs> six months in development. Well, we won't be able to play. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a shirt. <laughs> I want a shirt. I want a shirt. Yeah, I want a shirt. Uh, we've got Team Scotland. You get David Reid and the boys down. The Scotland and the Irish lads. Yeah. The could, Irish lads are always yeah. uh, up for a, for a bit of banter and yeah. a good Saturday night. <laughs> yes, they are. Uh, they got the Wanderers. Wanderers. Yeah. Um, Old Toby. Yeah, yeah. The Yorkshire lads. Yeah. Uh, I'll tell you what could be a good one. Team Warhammer World. Jay, Adam, Nick. Yeah, they'd, have to, they'd have to leave their uh, one. But saying that, you can only have King's four. Landing. Have yeah. King's Landing. <laughs> you can only have four in a team, so yeah. the Wanderers would have to have a, either a Wanderers A and B or split up. A couple of teams, yeah, bring it. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. you know, it'd be really good to see you all there. Um, mm. We're going to do our best. It's going to be fun. To put on a really good event. It's going to be really fun. And until the next reveals and yeah. teasers. Which will be coming soon. Yes. We're not going to drag our heels with this now, no, so no, no, no. we'll have plenty more information soon. Yeah. I think by Christmas we'll pretty much have everything organised. There's a lot of stuff that might be subject to change because, like, say, with the new rules. So got, is it spring? We think they're coming something in? like that. Something along with us. So yeah, yeah. Anything that we may announce in the next couple of weeks regarding points or scenarios or formats, yeah. all of that has a big asterisk subject to change because come next July the game could be different. There could be better things to do. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to give it the best sort of platform yeah. possible. It's going to be awesome. Yeah, and we're going to try one thing I didn't mention. I should have mentioned earlier is. That the teams of four, uh, mm-hmm. so the teams of four have to bring two have to bring good armies, two have to bring evil armies, Correct. and it'll always be good versus evil. evil. So that's interesting as well, mm. uh, because that you know you got a lot of players who bring similar armies that have to pick and choose who brings what. Uh, so that'll be awesome. So I think we'll leave it there. We'll yep. wrap it up, and we will see you in the next reveal for the GBTC. See you next time. Now that.